Hi everyone, this is Lauren from Crave Vintage Jewelry. Today I want to show you how to make an ordinary pill bottle into a very attractive container that you can mail delicate items like vintage jewelry. So first, here's our little pill bottle. I've taken the label off, but you can see it's still a little bit on. Um, but I just did the best I could and it's just fine because I'm going to cover it up, make it all pretty. So I'm going to be using some contact paper today. And contact paper is sticky on one side. I've already taken the backing off, just like a sticker. You don't have to use contact paper. You can use any kind of paper that you like or have. I really believe in just using what you have around the house. So you might use a piece of printer paper or you might use... Um, some wrapping paper would be great. You just need a little bit of tape to stick it together. So there it is. Now we're going to put the item inside of the pill bottle. Here we have a pretty vintage pair of crystal earrings. Very delicate. Um, so what I'm going to do is I'm going to use some packing peanuts to cushion it. I'm going to put one in and by the way you don't have to use packing peanuts just use whatever you have around the house you might have tissue paper newspaper um, a paper bag a brown paper bag that you could rip up cotton balls all kinds of things will work we need to be creative and we need to reuse things so i've covered that first earring with another packing peanut now let's put the second earring in so they don't touch at all then I have another packing peanut on the top. So when you are feeling um, <clears throat> secure that, that everything's in there and it's not going to be bouncing around, you can put the top on. Make sure you get it on there. There's usually no need with a pill bottle to use any tape. So you can kind of shake it to make sure there's nothing in there. I don't hear or feel anything, so it's great. Um, now the top still looks like a pill bottle. Um, what are we going to do about that? Ah. That's right, we're going to use a sticker. Um, I always have a lot of stickers around. Maybe you do too. You can put that on top. This one I did cut to size. If you find yours is too big, it's really easy just to turn it upside down and cut around the edges. So that's it. This is going to go into an outer envelope of some type and it's going to get to the recipient unharmed beautiful and they're going to love it. So thanks a lot for watching Crave Vintage Jewelry and please visit my store on Etsy.